Ray has shown Susan how to cut up a whole lamb carcass. And the knife is only used for cutting flesh. Susan now she knows what the cuts are and where they come from, she genuinely seems to be conquering her fear of meat. It is slightly therapeutic. Yeah, you get it. <laughs> yes, yes. Now I want to show her how to turn a couple of the cheaper cuts into delicious dishes. We're mincing the shoulder to make North African spiced lamb burgers. It's great fun. I'm incredibly excited about this dish. I think it could be the one that cracks it for you. Into the mix goes the three C's, coriander, cumin and caraway. You're going to remember this quite easy. You've got some black onion seeds. That's a really authentic North African seasoning. Right. A little paprika adds savoury sweetness. This is the seriously hot stuff. And KN some fiery punch. What the hell, eh? <laughs> some people do eat meat like this, don't they? Oh, you. I can't imagine that would be any better cooked than it is raw. I think you've just invented a new dish. Enjoy it. It's nice. nice. North African spiced it's good for you. lamb tartare. <laughs> I have to say, your Sydney ones do look very appetising. These little patties need just a couple of minutes in a hot pan. We've got these lovely flatbreads. This right. is food to eat with your hands. It's street food, really. The little lamb burgers are piled onto our That's homemade that. flatbreads with salad and a yogurty minty dressing. It's been great cooking this afternoon. I'm looking forward to this a lot. <laughs> This is what you're here you for. To, you Come know, on, start, start bite the it, bullet, yeah. mm -hmm. chew the lamb. Oh, it's lovely. I'm, I'm so not, pleased I'm not, you like I'm it. Not just saying it. it is, I'm so it pleased. Is, it is really lovely.